The woman and the elephant get along very well, but one day the woman slapped the elephant. Do you think the elephant will attack the woman? Totally wrong. Fumai is a wild elephant, just like other Thai elephants, it was born in a tropical rainforest, surrounded by all kinds of wild animals, but Fumai's situation is worrying. Considered an endangered species in Thailand since 1986, elephants have a high status in the country, respected and loved by many, but they are not safe. The number of elephants in Thailand has been greatly reduced, and the biggest culprit for this sad fact over the years is logging, where some local businesses cut down huge numbers of trees for profit. While derivatives of wood may benefit people around the world, this practice has come at the expense of animal lives, with the destruction of Thailand's rainforest causing a dramatic loss of habitat. So the elephants had to struggle to survive, and that's why Fumai was rescued by a woman named Lake Chart. Over the decades, Chart has made a name for herself in helping wild elephants. Chart founded the Save the Elephants Thailand Foundation, which owns a sanctuary called Elephant Nature Park in Chiang Mai, Thailand. At present, there are more than 70 wild elephants living in this reserve, and they are well cared for and protected by professionals. To talk about the encounter between Chart and Fumai, we have to start with an outdoor adventure many years ago. At that time, Chart came to a forest and accidentally found a dying and very thin baby elephant, which was the Fumai. It was just born at that time, unfortunately, its mother passed away not long after giving birth to it, and the poor Fumai had to live with the elephant herd. Fortunately, the other elephants in the elephant herd took good care of it. During that time, although Fumai lost his biological mother, he was cared for by other elephants. To some extent, it can be regarded as making up for part of the lack of maternal love in his heart. However, the good times did not last long. Due to human activities, the habitat where Fumai was located was severely damaged. The ever-decreasing space and lack of food made life difficult for Fumai and other elephants in the herd. Under such circumstances something heart-wrenching ensues. The elephant herd began to fight among themselves due to the food problem. Some elephants even did not hesitate to hurt their companions in order to survive. The young Fumai could not take good care of themselves. In the case of elephants with a lot of meat and little meat, adult elephants will naturally leave food for their children, and poor Fumai often cannot eat enough, and even take a meal for several days, although Fumai can feel that he is receiving less and less love, what can he do when he is lonely? It can only bear all this silently. Due to the lack of adequate nutrition, the growing Fumai was getting thinner and thinner. When Chart saw it for the first time, Chart couldn't believe her eyes. She had never seen an elephant so thin. At this point, it is not an exaggeration to describe it as skinny. Chart knew that if the Fumai was not saved, it might not survive three months. She immediately called her team, and after a brief explanation of the situation, the team immediately sent someone to the scene. They carried Fumai into the car and took it to the elephant nature park. Chart called the veterinarian, who immediately examined the elephant and made a health assessment after learning of the elephant's condition. They found that the situation of Fumai was worse than expected. Fumai's body is too weak. Due to prolonged hunger, it suffers from severe malnutrition, which will not only affect its physical development, but may even endanger its life. In addition, there are large and small wounds on Fumai's body. It may have been attacked by other animals. Although it survived, due to its very slow healing ability, these wounds did not recover well. Some have even started to become red, swollen and inflamed. As an elephant rescuer, Chart is very distressed by this fact. She cannot imagine what this young elephant has gone through. What she has to do is to save the life of the baby elephant and let it pass. Have a good time. Several professional veterinarians operated on Fumai, infused it with antibiotics and nutrient solution, and cleaned up its body and wounds. With the full rescue efforts of the medical staff, Fumai managed to save his life. However, the subsequent treatment is more difficult, and Fumai has to survive postoperative infection and sepsis. 
At the same time, due to the lack of various nutrients in Fumai's body, it also causes its body to recover more slowly, which is a big challenge for elephants and medical staff. In order to help Fumai get through the difficulties, Chart decided to take care of it herself. She said in an interview, cubs like Fumai's age need the care of their mothers the most. What they need is maternal love and learning from their mothers. As a real elephant, although Fumai lost his mother unfortunately, I will give him as much love and care as possible, and I think I can become its human mother. In the following days, as Chart said, she completely regarded Fumai as her own child. Considering the weakness of Fumai's body, Chart prepared nutritious and digestible food for it every day. At first, Fumai would show resistance when facing strange human beings. Carefully, Chart noticed the emotional changes of Fumai. She could fully understand Fumai's behavior. In order to make Fumai feel at ease, she spent more time by its side, although this process is very difficult, but Chart can feel that the distance between herself and the Dharma is getting closer little by little, which makes her very gratified. During a long period of getting along, Fumai gradually accepted Chart. For a lonely baby elephant, the existence of Chart made him feel an unprecedented preference. It began to rely on Chart and liked it. Follow Chart's side, and sometimes make a little joke with Chart. Chart also found that Fumai became more and more cheerful and lively, and even took the initiative to make friends with other elephants in the reserve, which is a very good phenomenon. Years later, under Chart's careful care, Fumai became a strong and lively elephant, and it became a popular man in the reserve. Many people came to visit it, and the reserve became a practical experience site of the local school, many students come to visit and have a wonderful trip with the elephants. Whenever students come to visit, Chart always greets them personally and tells them many stories about elephants. However, during one visit, Chart accidentally slapped it while introducing the Fumai, and this surprised the students present, they were worried that the elephant would attack Chart, but Fumai continued to stay quietly beside Chart as if nothing had happened, which made the students very puzzled. Seeing the puzzled faces of the students, Chart explained with a smile that when Fumai was young, she would gently pat its body with a towel or cloth every night. In the sleep of elephants. So that's how it is. The students suddenly realized that the elephant had such a cute side. They stepped forward and gently stroked the Fumai. Perhaps it was because of this kind of warmth that the Dharma veins became what they are today. Chart stood quietly aside, and she smiled with satisfaction. At this moment, she felt the flow of love between humans and animals, which is what she has been pursuing all her life.